Well, welcome back. What makes tomorrow night's NCAA Volleyball Tournament even more fascinating is the fact that the USD Coyotes will face Creighton and the Blue Jays star player is from Sioux Falls. Zach Borg is in Omaha and has more on one of my all-time favorites, former O'Gorman standout Taryn Cloth. Welcome to DJ Sokol Arena in downtown Omaha, where in 24 hours the University of South Dakota makes volleyball history playing in their first ever NCAA tournament match against Creighton. To score an historic upset, the Coyotes will have to go through one of the best prep volleyball players in South Dakota history, Taryn Cloth, who knows a thing or two about USD since both of her parents went there. Are they going to let you back in the house after this? Absolutely. They love me more than they love USD. So It was always kind of like we went to the basketball games to watch my dad's old team or we went to a vo um, we went to one volleyball game, but it's, it was always kind of like the football and basketball games. In truth, blue was always Taryn's color dating back to her days at O'Gorman where she set virtually every program record for kills and attacks and caught the eye of Creighton coach Kirsten Bernthal Booth. She had a long way to go because she started so much later and you know she was growing into her body. Um, you know, and she came in her freshman year and played right side and didn't actually get a lot of playing time for us. And by her sophomore year, uh, really emerged as a, a star player and then has progressively gotten better each year. Cloth has blossomed into a Blue Jays star, leading them in kills, earning first team all Big East and MVP honors while taking Creighton to their seventh straight NCAA tournament appearance. Everything that I've been given, um, it's just, it really has been an honor and I, I had no idea that it was coming. Next spring, she'll play a season of beach volleyball at LSU as a grad transfer. But first, she'd like to take one more deep run in the big dance, one that requires ending the historic season of her home state team. USD is a very good team. Uh, we are going to have to come out really strong tomorrow. The Coyotes will be the last team to take the practice floor here in a few minutes. And coming up tonight at 10, we'll hear how they aim to make history repeat itself. After all, the last time they were in this building against Creighton, they won in 2014. In Omaha at the NCAA Tournament, I'm Zach Borg, KDLT Sports.